Tipsy One. Oh, that's a great start. Well, he picked the right side. It wasn't going to be easy to deduce well, just where he was going to play that. What an almighty stretch he made to it in the end, to reaching across. That was a, a bit of Djokovic, wasn't it? It's a great return of it. It's so accurate. Got together with Hordoff in Metz in France 2009 for the first time, Tip Saravage. what he had to do because he knew Tatarovic was coming in. He's come in far, far less than Hewitt has. Eight from 12, Hewitt at the net. One from four. The Serb. Well, a mere 21 strokes. Nice little change of speed by Tepsarovic a couple of times. Just put his uh, foot on the accelerator and then took it off. Just mixing it up. Long. Here it's charged a call left service line, the boss called out. Like he's grown wings, Carlos Ramos, in that chair. Oof. It's in! <laughs> they can't blame Ramos for that one. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> First service. He's kept very calm, Tip Saravich. He's not done anything to try and get the Hewitt faithful more antagonised or more supportive. But yeah, I think, it's, I think he's telling us how important this opening set is. And also, it was pretty frustrating because it wasn't a shot worthy, really, of a, an outright winner, as it turned out. He didn't hit it that hard. It wasn't all that accurate from Hewitt. It was lucky. So fall after four two to Psalovic. Not quite what it used to be. Again, sorry for apologies for the language from Hewitt. Yeah, I thought you were talking about mine for a second. <laughs>
Oh, that's close. That is very close. Here it's trying to call right near sideline. It was called out. Felt it in, looked in. Was it in? Yes. It was. Didn't actually make a huge difference, except that he has a first serve. Does he use his wide serve here? Yeah. I think he should have. It's his best. Beautiful time. Six and two, two seven. Well, he looks so disciplined, really. Can he take it all the way now in this set? Four set points. If he second serve, but he made the most of the two first stuff. so early on in the rally whereas the last time we saw it it had been waiting to come yes that in a way contradicted what he's been doing for most of the match thus far he was in too much of a rush two set points gone two remain oh Russian. that's a shocking call goodness gracious everyone's getting a little jumpy it was inside the line. Well, he hit the same surf. Game's lost. And to Ibsarevich with that clenched fist. Against, six. against an, an older man, it'll quieten the crowd, it'll make them a little bit less believing. 70 minutes virtually, he takes it to Psarevich, 7-6. So here we are on the biggest theatre of them all at the six Australian please, Open, the Rod Laver Arena, Thank you. early evening in Melbourne. And Leighton Hewitt playing his 17th all consecutive Australian Open in itself an extraordinary record yeah it's really quite something isn't it and it, it's just a it's a fascinating match up this one here as well because both players have kind of similar game style tip Saravich perhaps hits the ball slightly heavier heavier arguably than late knew it but what a match up it is long rallies well it's a mouth-watering encounter for a first round match worthy i would suggest of a certainly a round three round four match in previous years and what's fascinating as well is that Leighton Hewitt has a, a bit of a stranglehold on the head-to-head uh, -head. three one he leads over the years well, that, that is going back to uh, 2007 as well they've played uh, four times
And the break that we minutes. just saw to give Hewitt the uh, one love lead was the first break of the match. In the first set, both men had a break point opportunity, but neither took it. Tip Saravich squeezed past narrowly on the tie break. Seven points to four, so there's really nothing in it. Left for serve. And Hewitt comes into this match in, in terrific form. What a record in the Kuyon Classic he had last week, beating Raonic, Berdic and Del Potro. 30-15. Slightly uh, tightened up on that one, but a real competitor. You will not find a gutsier competitor than Leighton Hewitt, particularly on home turf or on home flexi cushion. And also, Paul, significantly, Hewitt said last week he's, uh, he's injury-free, which is the first time he's said that for, for a while, feeling fit, lean, and probably in the best condition for several years. And there it is, holds to consolidate the break, and Leighton Hewitt has his nose in front in this second set on Rod Laver against the number eight seed, Janko Tipsarevich. <laughs> 